For this project, you will need paper, a marker, a pencil, and something to color with. Crayons, markers, colored pencils, your choice. Hi, let's play with lines and patterns today. You will need a piece of paper, a marker or pen or pencil, something that'll make a black mark, and either colored pencils, crayons, or markers. You pick. To begin, you are going to make about six different kinds of lines across your paper. So I'm going to make a straight line. And I'm going to leave some space. I'm going to make a curly line. Let's make a zigzag line. Let's make about like a block line. And then I'm going to make waves. So you see between my lines I've made spaces that now I want you to fill in each space with a different pattern. From the presentation, you saw that pattern was a repetition of lines, or colors, or shapes, or a combination of all of them. I think I'm going to use markers today. I'm going to start my first pattern. I'm going to make some polka dots. So here I am making different types of lines. And then I'm going to start filling in each space with different patterns. I began by picking polka dots. So I finished my first pattern. It's hard for me to find that. Uh, so I did blue polka dots on a green background. So then I'm going to go to my next space and think of another pattern. I think I'm going to do red stripes. Here I'm making a pattern with red and pink stripes. There, I finished my second pattern. So now to finish your drawing in every space you see, I want you to think of a different pattern of lines, shapes, colors that you can add. So no two patterns are the same. I'm filling each space with a different pattern. I did blue zigzags. You can do patterns of different lines, different colors, but every space between each of your black lines is going to be a different pattern. Boys and girls, I'm almost done. I've made different patterns to fill up my stripes. There we go. Look, boys and girls, I finished filling in all my patterns. I did a different pattern for each space between my different types of lines. I used patterns of colors and shapes and lines. See if you can think of different patterns to create in your artwork. Bye.